a technology similar to guided missile systems inside a 50 caliber ammunition. Since the 2000s, DARPA has been developing a revolutionary technology that will give a new meaning to precision shooting, a self-steering bullet that allows snipers to take shots deemed impossible with conventional weaponry. Meet the Exacto, the dream of all snipers, a smart bullet with the potential to make a regular shooter perform like a true war legend, or even better. Hello and welcome to Warfare Today. A sniper's job is tough, but a military sniper's job is even more. Despite all today's military technology and its powerful and precise weaponry, it has proven to be not enough in many complex combat situations, particularly when given the additional difficulty of acquiring moving targets in harsh conditions, such as the Middle East's howling winds and sandy landscapes. Any missed shot means an enormous risk of exposure. Being spotted can also reveal troops, jeopardizing their safety and mission's integrity. So it is critical that snipers have access to cutting-edge technology that allows them to engage enemies faster and with greater precision. Regular bullets, on the other hand, haven't changed much since their introduction. Those are still as simple as they've always been, merely being able to go from A to B without any possible course alteration or correction. A new weapon technology able to change this scenario always seemed to be decades away. However, this could change very soon. The Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, or DARPA, launched a program that, according to reports, can do more than simply change the trajectory of a projectile. The Extreme Accuracy Task Ordinance, or Exacto, project started in late 2008. Led by DARPA and its partners Lockheed Martin and Teledyne Scientific and Imaging. Their primary goal was to create a high-precision long-range rifle capable of firing smart bullets, which are essentially enhanced projectiles capable of performing complex tasks other than following a predetermined trajectory. In fact, when fired from a precision-guided firearm capable of programming its behavior, this type of ammunition can change speed or even send data back to the operator. Although the concept is not new, the major development is in the size of the shell, which aims to be a miniaturized type of precision-guided munition. DARPA's Exacto bullet has already been tested against climate conditions that would overwhelm a regular sniper, and it can outmaneuver wind and dust, giving the operator nearly superhuman abilities. As the industry awaits its deployment, Exacto promises to bring the power of precision-guided missiles inside a small bullet. The project is truly the first guided small-caliber bullet in the world, capable of changing course in mid-air to hit a specific target. Nonetheless, over a decade after its conception, there is still no clear explanation of how the bullet works. The official description revealed by DARPA uses purposefully ambiguous terms. As it is written on their website, the system combined a maneuverable bullet and a real-time guidance system to track and deliver the projectile to the target, allowing the bullet to change path during flight to compensate for any unexpected factors that may drive it off course. Still, as part of DARPA's solicitation, specific system performance objectives, such as range accuracy and target speed, are classified. Despite the fact that DARPA did not reveal the exact distance, the agency stated that the technology would significantly extend the range of current sniper systems. While it has been speculated that the projectile used fins that shoot out of its body to redirect its path, the developers have not divulged any sensitive information about the inner workings. DARPA only affirmed that it includes new approaches and advanced capabilities to improve the range and accuracy of sniper systems beyond the, the current state of the art. Nonetheless, the new technology compensates for environmental forces as well as target movement. Indeed, as demonstrated by the test, the weapon may allow even an inferior shooter to perform like a professional sniper, or even better. Not to mention the enhanced advantages that such an exceptional piece of equipment could provide to a capable sharpshooter. According to the test footage, both an experienced shooter and a novice using the system for the first time were able to hit a moving target. However, the veteran was able to do it on multiple occasions, meaning that even this revolutionary piece of tech can't 100% replace a trained professional. Another factor that makes this kind of weapon so needed is the recent increase in the number of situations requiring snipers. When you consider how long it takes to effectively train a sniper as well as the high costs involved, this type of technology becomes even more crucial. After all, in the long term, it can cut both training time and costs. Adverse weather and lack of confidence, particularly from novice shooters, are two other recurring issues that Exacto technology can help with. 
After all, a situation that would normally cause an experienced marksman to flee can now be overcome by the use of this new kind of weaponry. Although the price of the advanced round has not been disclosed, it is expected to be less expensive than rocket-propelled missiles, which it could easily replace in certain situations. Current sniper equipment can regularly hit trucks from a mile and a quarter away. But the same cannot be said of smaller and moving targets. Captain Keith Bell, former commander of the Army Sniper School at Fort Benning, Georgia, shed some light on this cryptic projectile. The Exacto would be revolutionary. It will more than double our range and probably more than double our accuracy. There's no limit as far as I can see. So long as the bullet is stable, I think a mile and a quarter or a mile and a half is very attainable. The concept of a self-steering bullet itself signals an extremely promising future. If the munition alone can deal with wind, dust, and the multitude of other factors that reduce a sniper's accuracy while also lowering the chances of a missed shot and the risk of exposure, then the operator holding the rifle may become almost untouchable. Moreover, the programs aim to improve troop safety by increasing the shooter's standoff range and shortening target engagement time simultaneously by using fire and forget technology, which was formerly exclusive of larger projectiles such as the Javelin, Stinger, or Maverick missiles. A few years still separate America's military from this type of ammunition. But the most important thing is that Exacto is already in an advanced research stage with a high degree of success. In 2016, the Russians revealed they were also developing a smart bullet able to hit targets 6.2 miles away, but no images or data were disclosed. Therefore, the U.S. is at the forefront of this type of weaponry. In the words of program manager Jerome Dunn, True to DARPA's mission, Exacto has demonstrated what was once thought impossible, continuous guidance of a small caliber bullet to target. This live fire demonstration from a standard rifle showed that Exacto is able to hit moving and evading targets with extreme accuracy at sniper ranges unachievable with traditional rounds. Surely filling such sophisticated guidance capabilities into a tiny 50 caliber size was a major breakthrough in the industry and a milestone that opens the door to what could be possible to future guided projectiles across all calibers. The images shown, as well as the most recent information released by DARPA, are from 2014, implying that this project is already at a much advanced stage, perhaps already being tested in the field in top-secret operations. There are other very interesting initiatives being developed by DARPA, and I also intend to bring those to the channel, so be sure to subscribe for more videos like this. Also hit that like button to help the Warfare Today community to reach even more people. Thank you very much for watching.